Hey there, how is it going for you folks? Let me start with a question. As a recruiter or a business development manager working in an agency, how many events or tasks do you have lined up for you in a day, week or a month? I'm sure there are a lot, right? And most of these events or tasks are spread across your emails, your calendars, your notes, physical notes which might get lost. So we have got something over here which will help you get clarity on how does your day, week or month look like. Let me showcase the latest calendar widget that we have in our recruiter for dashboard. So this is the calendar widget. We have set it up as default for anybody who logs into the product today. And this will be seen as default widget unless you disable it. In case you're not able to view it, you can just click on add card here, click on event calendar, give a name to your calendar widget and then choose what kind of events or tasks you want. Let me walk you through what this exactly means. So recruiting events are the events which is associated with a candidate or a scorecard where you know you're interviewing them or you're having a follow-up call or something and sales events are events wherein you want to uh, pitch a particular contact or get in touch with them regarding uh, any follow-up or any clarifications and finally tasks are all the tasks that you have lined up for yourself so we have four show uh, options over here which is my events uh, team events, user events, and all events. In my events, you can just view what are the events that have been set up by you, whereas team events are the events that have been set up by your particular team. At the same time, if you click on user events, you can choose to see the events associated with a particular user. For example, if I click on Manan here, I'll be able to see what are the events associated with Manan here. Finally, all events show you all the events and tasks happening inside your organization. So I just click on save, you can just click on save here. So this is how it looks on the dashboard. So let me walk you through this particular widget. We have three views, day view, week view, and month view. Currently, this is set up on month view. Uh, if you click on week view, uh, this is how the calendar looks like, showing you all the events and tasks lined up for the week starting from 26th May to 1st June. Yeah, the calendar view for week is from Sunday to Saturday. And finally, the day view uh, show you the events and tasks lined up on a particular day. Uh, just a reminder here, the day starts at 9 a.m. So if you have any early calls or emails or tasks set up before 9 a.m., please make sure that you scroll on top. Uh, finally, uh, if you want to edit a particular event, you can just click on it. You can also find more information around the event, uh, like who are the participants, what is the description, uh, whose event is this and if there is a scorecard involved and what job candidate or contact is this associated with. Uh, if you want to edit it, like I said, uh, you can just click on this button here. You can change the title, you can change the date and time, you can change attendees, you can add, remove. And at the same time, if you want to add uh, more jobs or contacts or candidates who are associated with this event, you can add them as well and just click on save. Now, another thing that you can do over here is, uh, let's say uh, if you want to jump to what's happening on 31st, you can just click over here. So these are your events and tasks lined up for the 31st of May. You can again click on any particular event and understand what's happening inside and who are the participants and all the other information. But if you want to come back to your current view, you can just click on today here. This applies to all uh, the views, which is week and month as well. If I just, for example, I go to September 2024 and I just click on today, I'll be back to May 2024. So yeah, this is the new calendar widget uh, and I'm sure this will bring you a lot more clarity on how your day, week and month look like. What are the events and tasks lined up for you? Perfect then. This is Amok signing off. I'll see you around.